Hello, and welcome to Opera in Brief, the show that summarizes operas for your convenience and entertainment. Today we will be discussing Francis Poulenc's 1959 opera La Voix Humaine, or The Human Voice, based on the Jean Cocteau play of the same name. It's a study in how a woman's life could be improved if she only had nationwide coverage on the world's best network to suit all of your wireless needs. No more dropped calls, no more frustrated conversations with the woman downstairs, and no more getting tangled up in wires. Just a call guaranteed to reach your ex-boyfriend wherever he- Wait, ex-boyfriend? Okay, she's helpless. So we see this woman, Elle, alone in her apartment. The phone rings, so she picks it up. Sorry, wrong number. It rings again. Sorry, wrong number. Finally, her ex-boyfriend calls. She plays it cool. Yeah, I went out with my friend Martha last night. We had so much fun together, you know, without you. I couldn't sleep, so I took a pill. We had breakfast together. <laughs> Me put on an act? Of course not. They discuss their relationship, and she takes all the blame. But the thing is, their connection is really shoddy. The call is dropped, and technical problems really start to get to her. When her ex calls back, Elle admits that she lied and that things were kind of the opposite of what she said. She didn't go anywhere last night. She'd just been lying around in her nightgown. She didn't take one pill. She took 12 in a suicide attempt. She didn't have fun with Martha either. She called Martha to bring a doctor and save her. Wait, she says. Is that music? Are you out with that harlot again? Where are you? But she never really gets an answer. Instead, the connection fails a few more times and she gets increasingly upset. He calls her back and she is desperate at this point. Hello? Oh, you're angry with me. Don't lie, I know. Okay, all cards on the table. I've been sleeping with my phone by my bed the last two nights, and I really just wanted to hear your voice so bad. And now I do, and I love you so much. She keeps wrapping the cord around her neck, and she dies, probably? End of opera.